I was supposed to fly um, to Honolulu. A dream vacation Joanna Banasek was planning to take last month, but her flight was canceled because of COVID-19. She paid about $3,000 for two round-trip tickets. When Banasek called Air Canada, she was given two options, a travel voucher for the full value of her tickets or a partial refund. Both seem ridiculous. I don't know if I will be able to travel um, in the future or even if I want to travel. So she turned to her credit card company, PC Financial MasterCard, and filed a chargeback request looking for a reversal of the charges. Initially, they wouldn't consider her claim because the airline offered her a voucher. Later, she received this email saying they would open the dispute, but she might lose the airline's voucher if they did. Well, I was very angry. I think some people might be um, scared to proceed um, with a dispute if they hear something like that. Air Canada said they do cancel travel vouchers temporarily while a customer is disputing the charges. And if the claim is denied, the airline says it will restore the voucher. But that's not how it was communicated to Banasek. An air ticket is not a roulette game. Gaber Lukacs is the founder of Air Passenger Rights. He's heard from many Canadians in similar situations with different credit card companies. If the merchant fails to deliver, you have a right to dispute on the basis of services or goods not received. We reached out to PC Financial. They said it's their job to inform customers about the benefits and risks of the dispute process and that they're now providing their agents with additional training to deal with these fluid circumstances. Asha Tomlinson, CBC News, Toronto.